Hi guys, here is the new video from Victor. Not so excited. Anyway, so I'm getting this error that some people might get with the wall connector. So have a look. So this boy blinking six, six, uh, six times. So have a look at that. I'm gonna count. One, two, three, four, five, six. So, what well, this thing is a specific error that could be fixed. Number one, you can go ahead and plug and unplug with your vehicle, might help. Um, the only way to understand it's not charging, it's looking at the screen of the vehicle or the app, and you'll see it's happening and the vehicle won't get charged. Second one is going down to the breaker panel where, where the cable comes from, turn it off for 10 seconds, turn it back on. If it helps, it helps. If it doesn't, Try the next one. So next one, we're gonna go and press the button here. Reset button for a few seconds. Wait until the light would go green. Once it goes green, it should be okay. If not, then we're gonna repeat the cycle until it's actually fixed. So have a look here. So we're gonna release once it goes green. So it should be working right now. Grab the wire. In the port let's try so previously it was giving me the green the blue light just the same way and then it's going into this mode and there is basically the problem did not get fixed so it's still blinking we gotta go and keep doing it unplug it so we'll leave the cable somewhere on the side let's do it over again so this is a different signal green one goes on So let's try again. No, it won't work. As you can see, it is red again. I'm gonna release now. Anyway, this should be tried infinite amount number of times until it should work. It doesn't, let's try. Nope. And there's an error on the car. Let's do that while we're connected. So this is still blue. Ready to charge. Go into the vehicle. And let's do. Start charging. Start charging. So now it works. Okay, people, so it got fixed, basically. So now it got fixed, as you saw it, three times I tried, the third time I actually inserted the cable into the vehicle, it did give me the error, and then I just reset it as I was connected to the car, and it worked out. It could work without that connection, but try another one, basically keeping it plugged in, and it should help you. If it's not gonna go and fix the problem, try more and more, hopefully you'll be lucky. If not, then just basically contact Tesla, and see what they're gonna tell you. But um, these uh, tips should be helpful enough. So it is charging right now, you can see. It is also charging right in here. Yeah, my screen is dirty, sorry about that. Anyway, see you in the next one.